everyone, it's Carrie's Little Piggies here, and I'm super excited for Halloween. The countdown has begun, and you know I am doing cage tours this year for three cages. Four technically, but Marmy's cage tour, which should be coming up soon and before the Halloween cage tours. I can't wait for you to see that one. But anyway, I have definitely been preparing for Halloween and for decorating the cages. We've already got our house festive for the holiday. So let's get right into our collective haul because this is a haul of all the places that we've gone shopping to get some fabulous decorations. And let's just get right into it. So the dollar store and the 99 cent stores are the very first stores that I hit up anytime I want to get any kind of decorations. And oh my gosh, their Halloween stuff is just so, so super adorable. Got tons of stuff from there, so let me show you what we got. Here is the first thing we got. Look at this cute little adorable skeleton guy. It's a little plushy with the orange and white stockings. He's got a cute little witch hat. So, so cute. And it's all good and safe for the piggies. That You know they love their plushies. And then look at these two bobblehead guys. I couldn't resist them. I'm probably just going to use them as props for some photo shoots I plan on taking. And then I absolutely couldn't resist this. Look at this cute little Halloween owl. And it actually glows. I don't know if you could see the lights light up. It's so cute, I love it. It's definitely a photo shoot prop, but I couldn't resist it, especially for the price. The next thing I got from the dollar store was this little coffin-shaped cardboard treat box. It says boo, and then when you open it up, so cute. Look at that, it's got little cute ghosts inside. So I thought that would be great decoration too for the cage. And then I might put in some treats inside. It's a pretty big box, but I love it. And then I got all of these. These are all cardboard boxes as well. I've got three of them. One is of this adorable witch. It says Witch's Brew here. Look at the little skull and crossbones on the sides. The second one, look at it. It's Eek with the ghost. There's little Frankenstein's monster, little ghost on the side. I totally love it. And then the third one says creepy. <laughs> it's got a cute spider, the cute skeletons on the sides. And this skeleton is pretty cute though, even though it's supposed to be scary, I suppose. But I figured I'd put like hay and forage inside here, some other decorations in all their cages. Look at how cute that looks. And this is the next thing that I got and something that the piggies do like to chew on. It's great chew toys, perfectly safe. These are paper straws. Look at this candy corn one. I'm so excited about that. Got the orange and black polka dots. This one I absolutely adore. It is different colored spiders on spider webs. They're so cute. And then I love this one too. Look at the colors, they're all Halloween colors. So then the next thing I got from there were gel clings. This one here is just of a ghost. And look at the tombstone, look at the pumpkin. Cute little spider and bat. And then this one here is more the witch's theme. Here's the little broom, the little witch's feet. And unlike last year, the dollar store didn't have many ribbons that I really cared for. But I did get this beautiful orange and black chevron and this cute little lime green one. And the next thing we got from the dollar store were these spider webbings. And of course I put this outside of the cage, but it just adds more to the festive decorations. I got an orange one for one cage, a green one for the other cage, and then a purple one for the third cage. So super excited, and look, they have these plastic spiders on them too. And then last year I didn't have any lights outside the cages, but I thought this year would be fun. So I did get some purple lights. They're just mini lights that you plug in, just to put outside the cages. And then to cover up the lights, I've got this garland here. 
And look at this one. This one's a black and orange with little cute pumpkins. And this other one I got is a purple and black with these cute, adorable black bats. So that's everything I got from the dollar store. You would think I would be set, but no, I definitely got more stuff. So moving on, the next place that I love to shop at after I've shopped at the dollar and the 99 cent stores is Target, because Target has a dollar section that I absolutely love. And this is the first thing that I absolutely had to get. Last year they came out with these adorable bowls and I got a couple of the candy corn ones. But now that I have three cages, I need a third Halloween bowl. So this was actually, it last year would have sold for $3, but it was on clearance for a dollar. I guess they had an extra one and rather than, I don't know, give it away, they saved it for this year to release it. So I found this for a dollar. It's a cute little jack-o'-lantern ceramic bowl. It's good for their pellets. And because for some reason I felt like I didn't have enough paper straws, here are more paper straws. This one's the adorable chevron that I could not resist, of course. Oh, look at these ones. I've never seen these ones with these lime green ghosts. I love it. And then more gel clings. I found this one which says just Happy Halloween. And it was just a dollar too. As well as look at this one. This one says Trick or Treat. It's got these cute little colored pumpkins. And then for all three cages all over around, I got several of these just regular just pumpkin ones. So now I'm complete on all my gel cleans, really. <laughs> I got from Target is just this cute little metal pail and I have two similar ones that I had gotten last year that I put in the two cages but now I have a third cage. I couldn't resist this because look it says tricks and treats and it's got cute little Halloween candies. And the last thing that I got which is going to be for the photo shoot, look at this cute wood sign. It says home of the wicked witch and her little monsters. And I don't know why when I thought of this, I totally thought the floofs need a photo shoot with this sign. <laughs> so I couldn't resist, it was only a dollar too. And there you have it. That is our haul from Target. So the next place that we went to is a store called Hobby Lobby. It's a craft store like Michael's. It's just a little bit further away from me than Michael's is, so I usually get everything there. But I decided this time to just check it out and see what they had in there. And I'm so glad I did because I got a couple of things from there. And the first thing is this adorable wooden sign. I'm totally going to put this outside the cage. How cute is that? It says, all little monsters welcome. And then strictly for photo shoots, but I couldn't resist. Look at this. It's another standing sign that says, boo. The cute little metal spider, metal spider web there. And they were having a Halloween sale, so I couldn't resist. And what is Halloween without Halloween owls? <laughs> Look at this cute little metal sign. This is also a photo shoot prop, I guess you could say, plus decoration for the house. But oh my goodness, look at that little owl. I love it. And that's all we got from Hobby Lobby. And then the last place that's going to be featured in our collective haul and we had to stop by there to see what kind of pet stuff they had was PetSmart. So they usually have so many fun Halloween items and this year I found so many plushies it's crazy. So let's just show you everything we got. The first thing is this darling candy corn plushie. Look at this! It's got the little legs and arms too. I absolutely love it. And you must have a black cat on Halloween as well. But look, who could resist this adorable black cat plushie? Look at the little tail. <laughs> and then the third plushie I got is this cute little witch, little pumpkin. I love it so much. It's got all the adorable colors. And then I found these two things. Now, the material of this, I don't know what it is. It's some kind of plushy, like carpety kind of thing. I don't know. It's super, super soft. And so when I saw it, 
I knew that my piggies would love snuggling on it because it's just so soft. It's softer than the microfiber. I have no idea what material it is. But my piggies also don't chew on things like this. So I know it's safe for them. And I decided to try it out. So I got this one monster one. It's so cute. And it's in the yellow and purple. And look, it's like this long, long one. Because I guess for dogs it's a pool toy or something. But how cute would it be for them to just snuggle up on this cute little soft little plushy monster? And then this one is just another black cat. It's got like orange paws. <laughs> I love it. And then there are two smaller ones that I got that were of candy corns, of course. And these ones crinkle too, so that'll be interesting to see if the piggies like playing with it. And there you have it. That's our haul from PetSmart. And that concludes our collective Halloween haul. We had so much fun shopping for all these things. You will see all these things in the cage tours this year, which will be closer to Halloween at this point. But that's because I'm just waiting on the cozies that I ordered for the cage sets, which you will see hauls on that beforehand too. So I hope you enjoyed this video, everyone. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.